Hey guys, it's Chaotic Uprising here. Uh, today I'm bringing you a, a tutorial on Sony Vegas 10 and then basically what I'm going to be showing you is how to do a cool transition effect using the event crop pan tool I believe is what it's called. Um, so basically what you're going to need is two clips. Uh, I'll quick show you guys the uh, clip right now and basically what I do is just 540 Tomahawk off one of the buildings on Nuketown and what happens is the garage door next to where my enemy is opens and it zooms into the next clip which is a wall bang on Skid Row so now I'm going to show you how to do it so I've got my two clips here um, so what you're going to want to do is get to the point where you're going to want to do the effect where the garage door or the window or whatever opens and you zoom through it. So what you're going to do is select best full under the preview quality and sna save snapshot to file. So you're going to save that. It'll show up in your in your media bin or whatever. Drag it onto the timeline. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to have I'm gonna have to do this twice, so there are two different masks. So first I'm gonna mask out the garage door. So I'll do anchor creation tool. Oops, I'm not gonna be, this is not gonna be the best, so you guys take your time on this. Um masked it out there. And if you look in the video, it's just gonna show it like that. But to make it so you see everything but the garage door you're gonna select that mask in mode you're gonna do negative and just and you're not gonna really have to deal with the feather so if you open this up you guys are gonna see it's just black and your other clip is going to show through here now you could just do that you could add fade into the just play it fade into black or you can make it a little bit more interesting I'm going to I'm going to do it so that the or I'm going to show you how to make the garage door open. So, I'm going to copy paste this to another video track. But instead, I'm going to open this up, go to the mask, and I'm going to set this back to positive. So, if you look, it's going to show it like that. And next what you're going to want to do is you're going to edit the position. So, click the position bar down here. Um, and set it to about one one second for the garage door to open or whatever the window you're going to want to move this straight down like that and if we look in the preview oh whoops I forgot to do this the, the see through clip should be on top of the garage door or whatever that whatever you're using to, or whatever is being opened so as you can see here garage door opens and then this clip will play in the background and it will fade it will open garage door opens now you've got that so you're gonna wanna go to your clip with the see-through garage door which is this one Oh wait, whoop, wrong one, sorry guys. So it'll be the top one. Uh, drag your position to rate when the garage door finishes opening and then go to about a second on the clip and you're going to want to make sure lock aspect ratio is checked and disable enable snapping. Um, then you're just going to shrink this down and you're going to move this oops and move this onto the garage door like so now what you're gonna see I get my kill garage door opens and you zoom in and you've moved on to your next clip and that's basically how you do this effect uh, subscribe like favorite this video if it helped uh, we'll be doing a 600 Microsoft point card giveaway when we hit 200 subs. So thanks, guys. See you later.